Alright, so today, guys, I have found the most broken KSP-45 classes up here in Black Ops Cold War. So, real quick, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Now, if we can get a like or today of 400 likes on this video, that'd be much appreciated. But real quick, guys, in the description, go follow me on Twitch. I live stream every single day. I'm getting close to partnership and as well, 20,000 followers. I live stream every single day. It's super fun over there. I show you my best class setups, my settings. Just have a great time over there. So make sure to do that. But anyways, guys, let me show you the best KSP45 class setup in this game. All right, so we're here with the class setup. And guys, I, I love the KSP45. Every time I use it, I just it's a crazy gameplay, all right? If you go through all my KSP class setups and videos, the gameplays I've just gotten with this weapon is beyond crazy. It's just because of how good this gun is it's just so good i love this weapon it's one of my favorite weapons to use one of my f fun weapons to use i should say and uh, it's just so fun so what you're going to want to throw on for the first attachment is the socom eliminator muzzle this can help with 17 percent more vertical recoil control now with it, it's a little different because on most guns i like to with burst weapons here for an example or majority of the time i don't like to use stuff that helps with vertical recoil control but how fast the weapon shoots of it being a burst weapon you need to throw on the socom eliminator because it's going to help with that vertical recoil control which is very helpful because if you don't have any control of your weapon you're not going to hit your shots and you're not going to perform as good as you want to so that is something that's definitely needed now the next attachment here is going to be the 10.5 task force barrel this is going to help with damage effective damage at range and bullet velocity now this is very helpful just because the weapon in my opinion um it's not as strong so definitely having stuff to help with damage you know stronger bullets at a longer distance and as well making the bullets travel faster in air is going to be very helpful this is going to make the weapon really really strong and it's just going to be super fun to use you'll definitely see a difference but if you try to put on the ranger barrel than the task force barrel just the task force barrel is that number one attach for this weapon here the next attachment here is the steady aim laser now the steady aim laser is going to help with hip fire accuracy now this is just if you just like you know, like a hip fire spray like a random hip fire spray uh you need to throw that because most of the time or i should say sometimes you're not you're not going to be able to aim down sights every time you get a shot off so you know hip firing is definitely really important just in case you need to do that emergency hip fire to get to continue your streak or whatnot so this is a very good attachment as well and plus i i don't use flashlights so now this one's going to confuse people now uh definitely it's gonna i know it's gonna confuse you guys i'm gonna be using the bruiser grip this is gonna help with three percent more movement speed sprinting move speed shooting move speed and as well aim walking movement speed so basically this is going to help you be more uh you know quick around the map get around to get to point a to point b super fast flank behind people faster although it's 30 uh, it's not 30 although it's three percent you're going to tell a slight difference on like how the you know the running is so definitely this is a very good attachment to run now the next attachment is the 48 round fast mag i have the magazine capacity going up to 48 bullets we have reload quickness starting out with more ammo and as well ammo capacity for the reserves you'll be able to hold more ammo which is very good you know if you have scavenger or if you have an assault pack this can be very nice because you're gonna be able to pick up more ammo from it so make sure you run this you're definitely never gonna run out of ammo using this so it's very nice the airborne elastic wrap is our next attachment this is going to help with 30 percent more aim down sight speed 90 percent more flinch resistance and as well you're going to be able to drop shot while proning which is very helpful very nice it's just a very good thing to run because of the uh you know aim down sight while proning you can drop shot and juke out your opponents the next attachment here is going to be the raider stock now the raider stock is going to help with 30 percent more sprint to fire speeds and 10 percent more aim walking movement speed so basically this is going to help you be more aggressive when it comes to getting in those gunfights of the sprint to fire speed and as well you'll be able to move faster while aiming down sight so you can be able to it's basically like stalker in a way so if you have that from mw3 or whatnot you'll know what i'm talking about the rest of the attachments here is the magnums we can have infantry compensator task force barrel 5 mw laser 12 round fast mag with dual wheels with stem shot c4 the trophy system with flak jacket scavenger and spycraft now i do hope you enjoyed today's video if you are new make sure to drop a like subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you on the next video peace
Alpha. How are we losing Alpha already? Spawn protection. I thought he was upstairs, bro. Shit. The goat man. The goat man killed me. These people don't know how to play a J on the other team. We're killing them too much. Yo, CF coming in with the Twitch Prime. Thank you so much, my man. Let's keep the sub hype. Let's keep the sub, not sub hype, sub train. Keep going. We're on a three sub train right now. Oh my god. What's that? Wow. The goat man looks like an anti. I don't know who is. Nobody's up here. Oh, Clav on what? YouTube? No shot. No. He said, uh... I mean, no, not against not against him or anything. Was it? Uh, do a YouTube club with Adox. Oh my god, someone clipped that, bro. Yo. No, fuck. That's fucking cool. Cracked my guy. Is that the AUG? No. Crazy org. I don't, are you talking about me joining an org or someone else joining an org? What's up, pro? Uh, this is easy at 120 plus if they can start playing objective next round. Let me bring that down a little bit. Seize the objectives. Authorizing 
Thought teammates were behind me watching me. Opinion on XP lobbies. Honestly, there's too many fake level 1000s now. It's not even rewarding when I hit level 1000. I'm just gonna be like, well, we did it. Wow, hip fire sucks on this game. What other games do you play? Uh, not really. Just Call of Duty only. What's up, Juju? Big man, Juju. Vacuum man, Juju. Play Warzone? Nah. What's up, Doom? Good morning, my man. How's your day? It's been good. We're gonna continue slaying out. Don't spill the tea. We may have to, Juju. I'm gonna get a quad feed right here. That looked like a quad feed. Securing Alpha. Mail operator neutralized. Alpha lockdown. I I knew he was right there, bro. Yeah, I'm already taken. I'm sorry. Losing a. Enemy took a. Yo, what's up, Nate? Big man, Nate. What is that? What is that? What is that? Uh, you can play competitive as well. No, I'm just a content creator. There's so many like there's all, there's so many grenade spots that you can do like that you don't understand Oh, I just got, just got barrel stuffed. You literally have all my classes. Let's fucking go, boys.
Okay, man, get out of my way, you will. 141 kills. Gee, gee, this gun's so good. 141 kills. Uh, I mean, I, I look for lobbies on my other account, on my other system. So, I mean, I, I'm, why would I lie to y'all? Nice, uh, thank you, Mara. Thank you. Maybe one day you'll play in one of these. Are you gonna join any orgs? Uh, maybe one day. I don't really know where they're spawning at. I have no. Oh, there's a guy. You got me my nuke. Thank you, gamer. Guys, AFK. Kills plus. Yeah. And this is just filler gameplay. I don't want to play in a. Oh, don't play in a reg lobby. You're probably those people on Twitter that just complain and bitch all the time. I wasted my money. I wasted my money. Yeah, this nuketown is quiet, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, it doesn't really require sniping, it just, uh... I don't know, I just, I'm not really... I don't know, I mean, I may try for phase 5 next year. Sorry, Damien, won't happen again. Well, don't you ever play Surge because it's too slow for me and I don't like only getting like 10 kills. And I'm a respawn type of guy. Oh, we just died. Favorite card to make content on? Uh, 
if I could go back and actually know what I was doing, uh, it would have been easily, 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 uh, Infinite Warfare. If I knew the knowledge I knew now, going back to Infinite Warfare, I would have blown the fuck up on that game. Hate that game. That game was super fun. Had over like 1700 nukes in that game. Shit was easy. Yeah. MW2 lobbies, yeah, those are fun too. That's how I got like my toxicity from like Modern Warfare 2 uh, lobbies. I remember like people saying like the F word, like you know the bad F word, I can't say on here. But I used to go around saying that around my house and my dad, you know, you know pop my mouth and be like, hey, watch your mouth. <laughs> I'm like, oh. Now I know what that word means. Advanced Warfare was shitty. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree. Although I played it. Got to level 1,000 in it. Not level 1,000. Pre prestige. Pre it's Prestige 30. Prestige 30. No, it was Prestige 30. Have you ever said the N word? No, I, I'll, I'll never say. I hate that word. Hundred and eight. We got like a we got like a forty fifty gun streak there. 